March 2023. Been about a month since we gave you an update on what's going on around Davis Auto Sales. As you can see from the lustrous amount of inventory over here on the car lot side 20 30 new vehicles have arrived some very custom trucks jeeps suvs check out the website so you can see everything that we've got in stock we'll carry you across the street and also show you some updates on the commercial side which is uh, changing every single day excitingly enough lots of different things happening over there so let's get to it building as you can see we've got some pretty good construction going on more progress being made uh, concrete got installed laid whatever you call concrete being put down time-lapse video coming getting ready to put in our lifts got the wall cut open where the big glass doors are going very soon you will see about 12 to 15 exotic cars classic cars and everything right there at your eyes you'll be able to view these things 24 7 Will give us really nice climate controlled indoor area for these cars we're pretty excited to say the least so look forward to that this will also give us more room to concentrate over here for our commercial vehicles um, which is a big part of our business obviously and we just got in i don't know 15 or 20 new trucks we'll shoot you a little quick shot of those it looks like skittles out here uh, if skittles owned a tow truck company i think we got it covered green blue black gray yellow orange and every single color of the rainbow here in stock and ready to roll fords chevys dodges kw's peterbilt's uh, freightliners international all the major brands extended cabs regular cabs crew cabs miller jordan dual tech all the manufacturers so very blessed there i think almost 50 tow trucks on the ground some of them getting ready as you'll see in the background uh, but a great flow of those and getting ready to really rack it up, literally, with the classics and the exotics in here as soon as we get this facility finished. So, appreciate you watching. All right, got this Impala that just came in. Um, Tim and AJ are gonna do a, a drive along video on this one, so be sure to watch the channel. This one should drop pretty soon really really cool restored car this was a local car uh, i've gotten probably a dozen vehicles from this particular customer he goes over them enjoys them puts his time and effort and money into them and then loses interest so thankfully that's a good thing for us bad thing for him but uh next owner of this car is going to have a really nice ride uh, as you'll see from the detailed video we're going to bring you also the other video that's already on there tires wheels ac system he's been over the car thoroughly so it is a jump in drive to a car show drive to a uh, cruise in or just have it in your garage with your collection this is a really really solid uh, as far as we can tell rust-free car we haven't got it up on the rack yet but from all the stuff we did laying on the ground and checking it out really clean car with some great background and a lot of upgrades so look forward to seeing that video come out and they, uh, they did a good job on that one So we're back in the uh, secret area. Still haven't told our guys what's going back here yet, but um, this racking has got to go. So concrete guy wanted to get back here and do his work, uh, getting that knocked out last week, but we still got this racking in the way. It's not gonna work for what we're doing back here. Uh, if anybody out there has a use for it, this was a Sea Ray dealer and they stack boats in here. It's about a hundred foot long, uh, about 15 foot deep. Uh, we'll hold boats up to 20 some foot down to little small could be used on a farm for pallet racking and storage uh, Lots of uses. We'd love to see it go to a good home drop a comment or give us a phone call uh, If somebody wants to come take this stuff down, I'll pretty much give it to them almost for free uh, It's a lot of scrap weight in here, but it's got to go It's holding up this next project and I'm excited to release what's happening back here We got all the security cameras in we got lights going in we got wire being pulled and I got this big pain in the 
you know what sitting here in my way so please reach out love to see you go to a good home any of our youtube followers has a use or a suggestion drop it in the comments let's figure out a home to get this stuff going All right, guys, I'd love to stand around and talk to you all day, but we got to get this next uh, episode filmed. Hit it up to the off road shop. We're going to check on Daniel and Brian working on the mud truck just to see what their progress is all about. I figure, what the heck, let's jump in the oldest thing we got and go for a ride up there. Battery was dead this morning, so it needs a drive anyway. So make sure you click and subscribe. This next video is going to be pretty cool. We're going to let a few cats out of the bag about the new truck. We're going to have some old episodes uh, and old clips of the old truck, which most new is Big Red. Um, check that out. Obviously, it crashed and burned. Um, new truck's been in motion. COVID slowed that down, but we're going to go get a little quick check on it and see what's happening. Click subscribe. Be sure to follow us. Lots of content to come.